Hey, yo, what's up, guys? Pasay Bader here. This is now the second game for today, uh, March 1st, 2023. This is Chicago Bulls going up against Detroit Pistons. That will be at 7 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. That's going to be 8 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pase Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. By the way, the spread that is given... Hold on. just want to make sure if it's minus 6 or minus 6.5. Um, it is minus 6. It was at minus 5.5, but now it is at minus 6. Okay, all right. Got it. So it's minus 6. And that's actually given towards the visiting team, Chicago Bulls. Now let's take a look at the standings and the rankings of both teams. Both teams uh, belong to the Eastern Conference. Chicago Bulls, they are at number 11 with a record of 28 wins and 34 losses. Well, for Detroit Pistons, they are dead last at number 15 with a record of 15 wins and 47 losses. All right, so here we go. Detroit Pistons, they would have the home court advantage on this. Um, in terms of fatigue, well... Uh, Detroit Pistons would also have the advantage because uh, Chicago Bulls, they were going at it against Toronto Raptors last night while Detroit was actually resting up. So, again, aside from the home court advantage, uh, fatigue-wise, Detroit Pistons have a bit of an advantage as well. Um, and let's take a look at the momentum uh, for both teams. Detroit Pistons, they have been losing, man. Approaching this game, uh, they are on a five-game losing slump. While Chicago is also coming off a loss uh, yesterday. So let's take a look at their forms. Man, the forms both don't look good. I mean, Chicago Bulls, they have only won three times out of their last 10 games. Um, while Detroit, they have only won twice out of their last 10. So Chicago Bulls, uh, they're, you know, they are better, but they're not really good good, if you know what I'm saying. So let's take a look at the availability of the players and the health of both teams. For Chicago... Lonzo Ball out for the rest of the season. Javante Green is also out for this game. So two players out for them. Well, for Detroit Pistons, man, this was a bit longer. Um, uh, Jalen Duran, Isaiah Stewart is also out. So both uh, both of those bigs um, are out. Isaiah Livers and Boyan Bogdanovich are actually both listed as questionable. So... Um, Health-wise, I would have to say that Chicago Bulls would still have the advantage but because, again, there are only uh, a couple of players out for them as compared to Detroit Pistons wherein there are more names listed down here. This is a bit tricky, to be honest. Now, minus 6, uh, Detroit Pistons, they are at home. Detroit Pistons, they are well-rested. While Chicago Bulls, you know, they're coming off a game last night. And that was against Toronto Raptors wherein they lost by, I guess that was 6 points. Um, this one's tough because, again, Chicago Bulls, they will be playing their second game in two nights. So, uh, the legs must be tired. And I can't, you know, I can't just really discard Detroit Pistons because uh, even if they are at number 15, I really respect the way they hustle. I really respect the way, you know, that they, they try to win even though they even though they've been losing most of the time. But I think Chicago Bulls would, would, would be able to find a way on this. They have enough weapons. They have enough offen offensive power. I'm talking about DeMar DeRozan. I'm talking about Levine. I'm talking about their center. I'm talking about uh, Caruso uh, actually being activated uh, once again for Chicago. Um, and another thing is that uh, they actually need this game more than Detroit. I mean, uh, Chicago Bulls right now is at number 11. So they really would want to have like a hard push to make it to the number 10 spot or perhaps number 9 to make themselves a bit safer. Again, for Detroit Pistons, um, I'm pretty sure that they would fight for it. If, especially they are at home. They would have the support of the crowd. But I think at the end of the day, Chicago Bulls would, you know, would be able to win this one and cover the spread. So my pick would be Chicago minus 6. Again, that's Bulls minus 6. Peace out. Pass I love and God bless.